right now at 6, an eye-opening experiment. We're putting a bulletproof backpack to the test. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Topping our news at 6, we've seen sales spike for these bulletproof backpacks after mass shootings as parents scramble for ways to keep their children safe at school, and they can cost close to $200. Not cheap. So will yeah. these expensive backpacks actually stop a bullet? Well, our Melissa Egan teamed up with the Jones County Sheriff's Department to find out. It's a scary situation no parent wants to imagine their student in. And some are turning to these so-called bulletproof backpacks for an extra shield. I bought this backpack online just days after the Parkland shooting. It cost about $120 and it did take a while to get to me. Right now, this backpack, the specific brand, is sold out on Amazon. If you look inside, you can see that there is an armored plate in the front panel. But other than that, it feels and looks just like a normal backpack your student might have at school. Right now, I'm with Major Tedford at the Jones County Sheriff's Department. Have you guys been seeing a lot of these backpacks around. Melissa, we have not actually seen the backpack. We've heard a lot about these backpacks, but we've not actually seen them. And how would you say this is comparable to the vest that you are wearing right now? Well, actually, it, it feels in very much comparison to what we wear on a day-to-day -day basis with our body armor. Both the backpack and vest have the same certification when it comes to ballistic resistance, level 3A. These boxes are full of 40 gallons of water, comparable to the size of a kindergartner, and we put a school book inside. First up, a 22 caliber long rifle, then a 9 millimeter and 40 caliber shots, all stopped by the panel. It's not penetrating through the fabric, but it is that that force of the bullet is actually what's causing the damage to the school book. So it's stopping the bullet, but the impact would still be felt by the student. Absolutely. Next up, two 45 caliber rounds and then 357s. A lot of impact. A lot of impact. But it does not appear to have gone through the material. Going hot. Finally, the 223 caliber bullet with a rifle used in the deadly shooting at the Florida High School last month. We added two more books for this round. The bullet slices through the first book, but is stopped by the second. That's the lead. That's the projectile of the 223 round. For our final test, we took the books out. Going hot. The bullet shooting straight through the backpack. It's eye-opening to us to be able to come out here and test this backpack. The Guard Dog Security Pro Shield backpack stopped 11 of our 12 shots with a book inside. Something Major Tedford says could keep your student moving in danger. So I do believe that it would be a very, very valuable tool for students to look at purchasing uh, and have on them at all times. On your side in Jones County, Melissa Egan, WDAM 7 News. Another thing for students to remember how they wear a backpack in a potentially dangerous situation. If you are in a room, the backpack should be in front of you to protect your vital organs. Major Tedford says if you have been told to run from the gunfire, wear the backpack as you normally would. We have more about this fascinating story mm -hmm. on WDAM.com.